Wilson, we are pretty deep into the Olympic events now, but there is still plenty of action yet to see in London. Our own Rebecca Clough is there. She is live inside Olympic Park. Rebecca, you talked to a couple of Olympians from the Rockford area today. I did. You guys, of course, know Grant and Ross James, the U.S. rowers from DeKalb. I met with them today just outside Athletes Village to talk to them not only about their amazing race, but missing the bronze by only three tenths of a second. It's, it's really exciting. Last 500 meters, the crowds are just cheering and roaring. We couldn't hear anything, absolutely nothing. It was so loud. It was an amazing feeling. But uh, to come that close and to look at the and see three tenths of a second is all it was going to take. So this is going to hurt, but uh, it is what it is. We have to make it Grant and Ross James could not be mistaken for anything but world-class athletes. When I met them outside the Olympic Athletes Village, they were swarmed by fans from around the world asking for autographs and pictures. Oh, that's terrific. It's just such a huge stage. Like you never, I mean, growing in the United States is it's growing, but it's not as huge as it is here, especially not at this level. So just the fans and just like the treatment you get, and you just really feel professional. Despite the heartbreak of missing a medal, the two are happy with what they accomplished, placing fourth in the world. It's the next level of the international stage. So it's very exciting. It's kind of thrilling. It's a little scary at the same time. But, uh, it's pretty cool to represent your country where the U.S. Is. And of course, you can see Grant and Ross again on Sunday, right here on WREX. They're going to be walking in the closing ceremonies to end their Olympic experience. Eric and Katie. Rebecca, you just got your first taste of Olympic Park today. What was it like there? Well, I have to say it's amazing being here. Of course, I did just get inside Olympic Park for the first time. The events were just all ending, but it was so great to see everybody pouring out of the different stadiums, and they were all wearing different flags from their countries or wearing shirts that represented all of what they what countries they came from and it was just it's beautiful inside here it's so clean it's so nice and so it's really great to be inside of this and even people who don't have tickets to these events they actually they have a chance to bump into these athletes and that's pretty cool there's a there's a kind of an interesting place to do all that right yeah, actually, it's where I met Grant and Ross. I met them at the mall right outside of Olympic Park. Now, if you don't have tickets, like I didn't have tickets today, you can stand there and see the entrance into the Athletes Village or into Olympic Park, and people stand there to athlete watch or to grab some pictures with people. But it is, imagine Woodfield Mall and times that by 100, and that's what it's like inside there. It is just crazy filled with people, but everybody is just having a great time, and everybody's really in the Olympic spirit here. All right, Rebecca, what an awesome and amazing experience for you. Thank you so much for sharing it with us. We appreciate it. Have fun, Rebecca. Thanks.